Dímelo! Dímelo, Bo Dominican Joe! What's going on, everybody? What is going on? Um, real quick, man. It's been a good day so far. Um, I rocked these primarily all morning long. And I've been rocking these for like two days. And I gotta say, man. People stop sleeping on the freaking Fear 3s. These things are tanks. They're gonna get their toe box wear. You're gonna see the wrinkles. But they're fucking tanks. I had mud all over one shoe today. And I just wiped it down. I used regular uh, wipes. These are non-brand. Or they have, there's a brand, but it ain't nothing. And I got stains and, and whatever. But to me, that adds character to the shoe. Oh my god. Listen. I cleaned the bottoms up. I walked the dogs, uh, obviously went to the store, and yeah, man, I, I didn't notice walking through a puddle or how I got mud all over my shoe, I had fucking shit all over the bottom, so I've, and yes, I, I'm holding them, but I, I already did a thorough cleaning with my, uh, believe it or not, I got a wire brush, I gentle with the wire brush, but stiffer or a little more vigorous with the nylon brush. Yeah, man, these this I don't remember if it was this one or the other one, but they were fucking filthy, and all I did was wipe them down. I just wiped the suede down with a with a freaking wet cloth, with a wet, uh, with a wipe. Don't sleep on these; they're still below two hundred bucks, almost everywhere, probably retail, even at the resale shop. So, if you want a full uh, a Jordan three. A Jordan silhouette that you could just put on and is pretty comfortable from the get. You don't really have as much of a break in time. That matches a lot. Now it's got the big pop of orange in the back. And of course little hits of orange in the front and the big pop on the tongue. But you see the way I got it laced? That really covers up a lot of the orange on the front. And really it's just the back. But if you're wearing jeans or baggy, baggy sweats like I was today. Don't sleep on it. This is something that you can grab for as little as a hundred bucks if you know how to bid properly and you catch somebody at the right time who just wants to let it go and let it move. Get it sold. You can get these for as little as a hundred bucks if you are aggressively bidding on StockX, GOAT, and whatever other platform that you use. Again, I'm not condoning or the buying, you know, through through uh, apps and all that, but they don't pay me, but I do. Anyway, thank you for hanging out with your Uncle Bo. Get back to the rest of the day. Hope you guys have a blessed one. Happy Wednesday.